Oh, yeah. Oh, rest, rest your middle is over. All right. What's up, CrossFit Open Plan? Waking up for my nap here. Really just waking up for my rest interval. So today in Garage Fight, we have rest intervals. Now, a lot of people miss out on why we do rest intervals. So I wanna sit and talk to you for a moment. Big thing about rest intervals, they're our best way to test our recovery. So can we take a break from something, recover and get back to it? A lot of us think it's not important, not that big of a deal, it doesn't matter in the workout. Oh, it just saves me. I actually think it's much scarier when I see a workout with rest intervals. Because what it tells me is now I have no excuse. Now I have to work hard. Now I have to get to work. Now I cannot take it easy in the workout. So today, when we finish the burpees, which by the way is probably the worst thing you can put before rest because now there's no excuse. You can always do another burpee. You can always keep moving. So when you are working through this workout and you get to those burpees in each round, you need to keep moving. You need to keep fighting. You need to keep pushing. This is where you prove your toughness. This is where you tell the mind to go away and you keep pushing and working. This is where we want to push you. This is where in Zoom class, I'm going to be on people. I'm going to be yelling at people. I'm going to be getting people rocking and rolling because I know the moment we turn around, you can collapse on the floor for 15 to 20 seconds and then you can get up and start breathing again. So let's talk what we should be doing in our rest intervals. First, recovering, starting the breath back. I actually want you to stay still for a moment. You can do that standing, you can do that kind of wiggling and moving because it is a short minute here. But it's very important that you're not fidgeting with other things. If you can get up and go walk and check your phone, if you can get up and do this or that, you didn't work hard enough, to be honest. So call yourself on it, hold yourself accountable, push to that next level, especially on those days when you're tired and don't want to, or when the days when you're stressed, get out of your head and get into your body and get moving, okay? So really push there, besides just recovering. Find your breath. See if you can't control your breath in through your nose. <sighs> controlling your breath, controlling your breathing, working on pulling everything back into your body and only breathing in and out of your nose. One will lower your heart rate, lower your stress levels, lower everything else, which by the way, you should be doing all the time, especially right now. It also will help you become a better athlete, help you also become ready for the next thing. So if you can't get those deep belly breaths, Breathing like that, boom, magic will happen there. Last but certainly not least, get your mind right. So last 15 seconds, 10 seconds, get your mind right. Get your mind wrapped around what you're about to go do again. Get your mind ready for what it's gonna be. Yes, it's gonna hurt. Yes, it's gonna be hard. Yes, it's gonna be challenging. But this is where you build grit. This is where you get ready for the rest of the things that come at you in life. And this is where you build and develop that skill, that strength, that power that all of you have and impresses all of us coaches so much. So get after it. Get your mind right in those last 15 seconds. So again, first 15 to 20, recover. Stay still, move, breathe. Next, make sure you're breathing through your nose and only your nose, into your belly, all that good stuff. Lastly, or fourth, little sips of water if you need it. Nothing really big, it's just kind of getting that cotton mouth out. And then lastly, get your mind right. Get ready to rock and roll. That's garage fight today in the rest periods. So get after it, have fun. This is gonna be a nasty one and you guys are gonna do fantastic at it. All right, I think I've talked long enough. I'm going to go back to my nap. You guys have a great day, and I'll see you in the gym.